Welcome to the Nissan Nismo Insider. I'm Alicia Kelly, and today we're going deep into propeller head territory, the engineering department. At Nissan Motorsport, we've got seven engineers, with each of them having varying roles to play. Let me introduce you to them. This is Eric Pender, a former Bathurst and championship winning engineer. Eric is responsible for Rick Kelly's Jack Daniels Nissan. Here is Perry Kappa, formerly with Dick Johnson Racing and Techno Autosports. Perry can be found working as Todd Kelly's race engineer or clocking up hours on the snowfields. Alex Somerset looks after James Moffat's racing exploits and was also the chief designer of the Nissan Altima's aerodynamics package. Michael Caruso's race engineer is Stephen Todkill. When Caruso joined our team from Gary Rogers Motorsport, he brought Killer with him, hoping to add more race wins to his tally. Jesse Walker and Nathan McColl are the team's performance engineers, responsible for data at racetracks. Away from the track, Walker is one of the team's leading designers, while Nathan is our simulation expert. And the man at the top of the pile is Craig Spencer, who last year came from Mercedes Grand Prix to work here at Nissan Motorsport. I've got Nissan Motorsports Engineering Manager Craig Spencer with me. Craig, there's a great team of engineers working here. Tell us what a race engineer actually does. Uh, there's six in the engineering department, two performance engineers, four race engineers. Three out of the four are design engineers, so they come back, do all their debriefs, post-event reporting, planning, initial planning for the next event. Three of them get into the design status. Uh, out of that, two are on chassis, one on engine side of things um, and that takes them through to roughly four days before uh, the next event so then they get into pre-analysis, pre-meetings, planning, uh, car specs have already been done um, a lot earlier on. Performance engineers out of the two of them, one is design based also um, and his code specific uh, VBA um, and then the other one is uh, simulation uh, code specific VBA projects. At the racetrack, what does an engineer do? They're working with a performance engineer and driver to try and uh, extract the best setup um, out for of the car for the for the given conditions on the track on that day and, and for the next day and plus on the uh, specific type of event whether it's a pit stop event so you look at strategy um, whether it's not and then concentrate probably more on setup side of things for outright performance that uh, takes up most of their time. I'm here with performance engineer Jesse Walker. Jesse besides the obvious what does a performance engineer do? Uh, well our responsibility on the weekend is to you know go through the telemetry, the data, download the cars uh, give the race engineers all the information that they need and uh, keep track of the balance sheet and just make sure things sort of run smoothly in the background so that the race engineer can uh, communicate with their driver all the changes that they need to do and uh, keep on top of their stuff there. Uh, when we get back to the workshop the performance engineers uh, they multitask a fair bit. We go back and we do de uh, design, uh, electrical work and just sort of keep things ticking along back here so that the race engineers can focus on, uh, on keeping their cars going. For more information on Nissan Motorsport, head to our website. And to catch up on past episodes of the Nismo Insider, click here now.